Hello and welcome to this insomnia session or sleep hypnosis session. So this is the first one I've ever done where I've got two microphones. I'm using the Rode microphones, which is, they're supposed to be, well, I've, they are good. I've already used one, had one for a few months, but I could only record in um, mono. Now I can do stereo, so you've got both sides. So you'll hear this out of the, either the right or left side. I guess right side, because that's it. Anyway, I hope that the sounds okay and I'd really appreciate it if you let me know how it sounds for you. I'm sitting in my big black chair and I think the, the back of it's a bit wonky, but this is the first time that um, I've had this set up before, so it's a bit of a, it's a bit new for me, but I hope that you like it. I hope that the sound is good. That's what I'm aiming for. There's not a lot I can do about the picture. Um, as far as I don't have any way of getting a better camera at the moment. I hope that this will do for now and that the sound will make up for that and then hopefully by the end of the year the end of next year rather 2017 I will have a decent camera so I was thinking about doing a an insomnia session you know a hypnosis for sleep session every day of the year uh, during 2017 and uh, I'm still playing with that idea I'm still playing with it I'd like to do that but it's a big commitment it's not just a big commitment but it's I don't know if I'm able to do it I don't know if that I can if I have that much in me to talk about so what I thought I'd do I just do a standard session for deep sleep now and I'm going to release this today which is the 29th of December and just let me know how you find the sound the quality and let me know if you like it so I will end up closing my eyes I might take my glasses off although I can't see anything without them but uh, not that I need to see anything with my eyes closed which is the next step I say to you please only ever watch or listen to my sessions when you can safely close your eyes so now I'd like you to get yourself into a comfortable position lying down on a comfortable bed or uh, even a settee, sofa, maybe even on the floor if that's what you choose, or sit as I am in a comfortable chair. And it's worth remembering that you are allowed to move. You know, you are allowed to move around if you need to. You don't have to just stay seated or laying in that exact position. 
So if you feel that you need to move your body to increase comfort for yourself, then do so, do whatever's necessary for you. Because there's no point doing this unless you're comfortable. It would defeat the entire thing, really. So, I'm just going to do like a very vague body scan. So I'd like you just to just get in touch with how you physically feel right now. How do you physically feel right now? So there's no right or wrong answer for this. It's just whatever is, is the answer. Whatever is, however you feel is the right answer for you. No right, no wrong answer. It's a case of just allowing yourself to be here now and to not try and push away any specific feelings, not trying to hold on or grab any other feelings, even pleasant ones. It's just a matter of accepting how you feel this very moment. And how do you feel emotionally as well? How you feel emotionally may be dependent or affected at least by how you physically feel. That's a pretty normal and natural response to have. In the same way that your body can react to how you emotionally feel and the thoughts in your mind can affect how you physically feel because your mind and your body are connected of course and just noticing what emotions you have maybe maybe you find yourself getting impatient with me maybe you think I'm talking too slowly or you wish I'd just get on with the hypnosis and just get on with the you know sleep part of the session instead of waffling on about how you're feeling emotionally and that's okay because that's just how you're feeling again there's no right or wrong answer to that it's okay to feel however you feel. You can enjoy knowing that the reason that you're feeling things is because you're open. Because you're aware. You're aware of the things that you feel. You're aware of knowing. Of noticing those emotions as well as those physical sensations that you experience in your body and being aware of those things can be quite nice in some ways even if it's a feeling that doesn't feel particularly pleasurable It's a feeling that you're not really, that you don't like. There can still be part of you that actually appreciates yourself 
for noticing those feelings and for just letting them and allowing them to be there. And for not beating yourself up inside for those things that you have no control over. And for not saying horrible things to yourself, having a go at yourself, telling yourself off for basically just being a human being with feelings and emotions and physical sensations, some of which are pleasurable, some which aren't. And it's natural to have a variety of different physical sensations occurring at any one moment. It's natural and it means that you're a human being. It means that you're alive. And no matter what emotions are going on in your mind this very moment, you can still give yourself permission to let go. You can still allow yourself to take some time out and to just relax. And this is it's something that's really quite amazing because it's as if you have your finger on the pressure valve the pressure where maybe there's stress, discomfort, those kind of things. And it's a build up and you really can just control that yourself by just turning the valve and releasing that tension from your mind and from your body. And just turn it in your mind, turning that little valve easily and naturally allowing those stresses and strains and memories just to drift away. As if melting each part of your body in the sun, warming those parts. Healing those parts of your body that need healing because healing occurs all the time we're just not aware of it the same way that we're not aware of our heart beating or our breathing a lot of the time of course you're aware of it now that I've mentioned it and maybe the breathing has slowed down and that's natural but it doesn't matter what speed the breathing is as long as it's healing as long as it's natural as long as you just take away any pressure you may have had about how your breathing should be because that's no use to you here your breathing is whatever it is now the way you feel physically is however you feel now and that's something really quite special giving yourself permission to just be available to those emotions that you experience in this very moment and to be available to those physical sensations within your body And as you notice those things, those feelings, those emotions, you also 
start to notice how they are constantly changing. Sometimes due to intention, sometimes just because that's what happens. All feelings, emotions, sensations are always changing all the time because nothing stays the same. It's just that sometimes we don't notice it because we're not focusing on it. And we can get caught up in our own self dialogue, our own self lies, in fact, that nothing ever changes. And, you know, I always feel this way and I always feel that way. And you're always like this and you're always like that. As kind of generalized, uh, maybe lies is a bit of a strong word, but silliness, maybe untruths, generalizations. Everything changes, and that's just the way it is. Don't need to read a book about it. Don't need to do anything. Just accept it because it's true. Everything changes. We are constantly changing. Our thoughts, our body. We are aging. Since the beginning of this session, we have all aged. Something within us has changed. Other people's lives have changed during this time. The world is changing constantly. Right this second, there are babies being born somewhere in the world. Somewhere somebody's eating a bar of chocolate. Somebody, someone's eating a curry. Somewhere, somebody's having a bath. Somebody's watching television. Someone might be at work, working in a lighthouse. Everybody's somewhere doing something and their life is changing and unfolding, just like yours and mine. And together, during this period of time where we spend together, our lives connect in an unfolding way where we can become relaxed, where we can realize that because everything changes It reduces things like worrying. It reduces stress levels naturally and easily because that's the obvious response. In fact, it's the only natural response among others. When you realize that, that pain, whether it's emotional or physical, is never going to last. It's going to be there for a certain amount of time and then it will reduce. Then it will vanish. In the same way that the waves on a beach come and go and the tides come in the tides go out. You know, the days get dark and then it's light again, night time, day time, night time, day time, constantly changing. Just look outside the window and watch the moon. The moon's moving. 
quite quickly. I don't mean in, you know, uh, astronomy terms, but just in visual terms. Just in the time it takes you to have a bath. The moon would have moved quite a distance in the sky from where it was before. So if the moon is constantly moving, constantly changing, then it makes sense to also, so are we. Because this planet is constantly changing. The temperature, the seasons, the weather, the quality of air. constantly changing and the benefit of realizing that means that then you let go because that's the natural course of action and when you let go falling into a deep natural healing sleep it's so much easier. So much easier just to let go completely. To really, really just enjoy knowing that you really can drift far away, drift into a deep, deep natural healing sleep. And there's nothing to get in the way of this. There's nothing to stop you from enjoying this. You really can have a lovely time accepting yourself. You really can have a lovely time just being there for yourself just letting go, knowing that you're safe. And that's one of those things that self-acceptance gives you. Safety. Feeling secure and safe within yourself. It's such an amazing thing. allowing you to move forward in your life and now allowing you to just let go sending each part of your body to sleep easily and naturally and there's something quite calming about knowing that you really do have the ability to just let go so easily so naturally letting go bit by bit day by day it becomes easier 
so that there will come a time when just by turning this session on listening to my voice you just naturally drift off into a deep sleep and it's as if all the other words that were said previously you've heard it before allow my voice just to wash over you causing comfort and calmness and deep relaxation in every part of your body and even when I repeat certain sentences and still talk about your body and your mind relaxing and falling into a deep sleep you'll still find sleeping so much easier right from the start because you've already heard me say these things before and every word I say right from the beginning can just lead you into that sense of comfort and safety to just drift into a deep natural healing sleep in such a way that you really can appreciate yourself for allowing yourself to just let go for giving yourself permission to allow each part of your body to fall into a deep deep healing natural sleep and maybe you focus on different parts of your body noticing how easily and how naturally you really do drift into a deep healing natural sleep so easily and there's something quite special about knowing that the more you do this the easier it becomes it's as if my words become part of your body the positivity becomes part of your mind and my voice alone can relax each muscle that you possessed to just relax and just melt and all your major organs can just completely feel calm inside as the healing takes place healing and rejuvenating all those major parts of your body internally it's as if you're giving each part of your internal body a kiss a kiss of love saying thank you thank you to your heart thank you to your lungs a thank you to your kidneys a thank you to your liver to your pancreas thank you to your abdominal area thank you to all your digestive system thank you to your spine such an important part your being connecting your brain to your body
And of course, a thank you to your mind and your brain for all that it does for you every second of every day for all the love it has for you caring for you like a child because you are your brain's child you are the most important person in the entire world to your mind which is why your mind loves you so deeply and will do everything in its power to keep you safe and happy and healthy which of course involves sleeping deeply whenever you choose to just let go and drift into slumber just letting go of any preconceived ideas about anything letting thoughts drift away allowing any memories to just dissolve and any ideas or thoughts about the future and just melt like butter in the sun causing your mind to feel even more relaxed and calm you can feel that sensation from your mind drifting and dripping down your spine moving down sending each part of your vertebrae to sleep naturally in a, in a healing way and as your spine continues to feel more drowsy every part of your body naturally falls into a deep healing sleep and your mind can just drift as if turning off the brain the period of sleeping deeply and allowing that part of your brain that's there and in control of sleeping deeply to take over to be there for you and to keep you safe throughout your healing sleep and you can just allow those feelings whatever they are to just be there and to drift and to just melt melting and drifting 
calmly, letting go. Easily allowing your body to feel even more relaxed and sleepy. Easily. naturally you can let go really really Let go. And enjoy the physical sensations that you can experience. And just allow yourself to just enjoy knowing that you really can feel amazing. You really can enjoy drifting off into a deep healing natural sleep easily and naturally feeling completely wonderful There's nothing more to do just drift off if you haven't already drift off drift